from a young age, being around so many incredibly talented people who are in many professions, I knew to get to that point, I had to start early and I had to build good habits. I want to do big things in the future, and that starts with my education. My name is Alina, I'm 14 years old, and I'm from Beaverton, Oregon. In the morning, I go to the high school and take my classes, and after I'm done, I take a bus down to the middle school because I am an eighth grader and finish up my day there. Her parents were very proactive parents as far as her schooling and her education. She started out with reading because they felt her reading needed some work, and then she asked to join the math. With Kumon, a lot of times, the hardest part is the motivation. She was always well motivated. She was always wanting to go farther and was willing to work hard to do that. I started to really like it because I was working towards something. All I would think is, I'm around 60 to 70 pages away from finishing the level. I can do this. And around fifth grade, I got my J by six. We have always emphasized setting goals. We've done that since long before Alina started. And so all the time that she's been in Kumon, she's checked her goals, and it's her job to be sure that she's following them and staying above them. See number two? That's homework. This is today's, and today's math is under here. She taught me about time management. She taught me how to organize my schedule to have a designated time to get Kumon done. That was a struggle for me, especially when I joined, because I just never wanted to do it, or I never could find time to do it. She always thought of me as an older student, and she always encouraged me that I could do more than I thought I could. My parents are actually from India, and when they got here, they realized, yeah, education is important, but they always taught me, you know, life is about living, having fun, and, you know, enjoying every moment. We're trying to teach the student to be independent. Little things like the student has to carry their own bag. With Alina, she was always one that was very careful to keep her bag under her charge. And now as an eighth grader, she is so completely independent. Schools have allowed her to go to high school math. There are times where the juniors or the seniors will ask us for help. And because I've been in Kumon and I've learned all this stuff, I'm able to help them and they're really appreciative of that, which is nice. She's the student that's asking to do more than we expect. She works very hard at that. She puts in many, many hours. There's not a lot of downtime in her life, and she's driving that. She always gave me this speech every single time that I would struggle. She said, there are times, especially in academics, that you're not gonna know everything. I don't know everything. Just persevere, keep going, and know that you're better than you think. I've really applied that in my academics, and I've really got to explore my potential, and that's gotten me to this point in my life. <laughs>